and salutations, everyone! Hi there, I'm Mark Epsilon with green screen Steph Gillingham behind me. Most of you guys know me online for the green screen guru stuff that I do, but let's take it a step further and add some virtual reality sets to make it look even more realistic in this episode of Mark Epsilon's Video Tips and Tricks, sponsored in part by TubeTape.com. <laughs> I have done lots of videos on chroma key online and also on DVD and it's time to take it to the ultimate level what chroma key was originally intended for and that is placing your subject in a realistic environment and we're going to do that in a very simple and easy tutorial using the virtual reality sets that are available over at tubetape.com there are actually five of them there's a conference room a podium hall a classroom a newsroom and my personal favorite, a spaceship. Now these come in multiple angles and also most of them are Adobe files with the alpha channel removed and they're also in HD. That's 1920 by 1080. So they're very high quality and you can do some really amazing things with them. And that's what I'm gonna show you in this episode of Tips and Tricks, how easy it is to do this. Well, getting the chroma key, you can see I have myself right here. Yes, this is chroma key. You don't need a large area to key and I'm going to show you that. Look at this. I shot this video in a very confined area. I have a light over here, a light here, other stuff over here. And what I did to remove that is just draw a mask around my range of motion, which is very easy to do. You just go over here and you click the anchor creation tool in Vegas Pro 9 and you just draw your points. It's a very rough mask, but it does what I want it to do and that is remove the stuff around me. Well, once I have that done, I just have the green and I can remove that by just adding the chroma key effects and the chroma key blur are there. And voila, I am keyed out. Now your basic chroma key is I would just drop something behind it like this, uh, this whirlpool blue imagery, kind of scary looking if I were stuck in it. It's like a black hole or something. But Chroma key is so much more, like I was saying, the dynamics. That's what we're looking for, and that's where I'm gonna take you in this tutorial. Well, the virtual reality sets, like I said, are very, very easy to do. And I've set up several different items here to run you through it really quickly so that you can do it yourself. And uh, I decided, you know, since I teach, it would be ideal to place me in a classroom setting. And that's what I've done, teaching video production in a classroom setting. Well, I have myself here. I've already gone through and keyed myself out and shrunk myself down because we want it to look like it should in perspective to the area we're going to be setting the subject. And that's why I'm shrunk down. You can de-shrink yourself and you do that by just going over to the uh, uh, track motion and just shrinking yourself down and moving yourself around just to what would be appropriate on the background you're using. Now the first background, which is the classroom, it'll pop up here so you can see it. You can see there's a big black area missing. Well, that's the alpha removed, and it's removed so that your subject can walk in front of these desks or behind the desk so that uh, it looks like they're in more of a realistic environment. Now, to take care of this black area, it's pretty easy. All you do is you just drop the full image behind your chroma key subject and let's unmute that so you can see it and voila you can see it looks like I'm standing behind this desk so it's really kind of cool and like I said you can move your subject around where you want to if you want them in different areas or if you want to have your subject floating around in the sky it's kind of up to you it's whatever you want to do it's virtual reality and you're the chroma key subject so you can do just about anything and what's great about this is if you really need a classroom setting to shoot a video and you're on a budget this is ideal because you can just do it with chroma key and not have to worry about acquiring a classroom to shoot your video in if you're doing a conference and you want to make, put together a conference-like video with multiple angles, well, you can do that. And I'm going to show you where I did that here. I'll click on this and bring up this file. You can see I'm behind a podium, and 
I switched angles, which there are multiple angles in each one of these sets, to uh, kind of give it more distinction and dynamic of a multi-camera setup. Now, what's cool is you can see I've got video playing in the background. Well, you just set that behind the actual image because the alpha channel is removed. So you can show a video or presentation or whatever you want to in the back. So it's very cool. And you can have people actually sitting in these seats too if you wanted to because you can import the seats separately. So it's uh, pretty awesome for that. Now my personal favorite is of course the spaceship because if you're shooting something on a very low budget you don't have the ability to build a model set for a spaceship. Well with the virtual reality set spaceship you can practically create an entire movie just using these sets and uh, it's pretty cool you can see I'm standing there but like I'm like in awe like whoa I'm on the bridge of the spaceship and it's cool and uh, that's kind of what it is there are there's a lot of cool interesting features like for instance this one up here you can see there's the black area removed well that is the alpha and it even has sliding doors that you can uh, place and remove to do some cool stuff with. And I put together something kind of neat here too that you guys might want to take a look at. And uh, I'll play it here so you can see it. <laughs> So the possibilities with the virtual reality sets in Chroma Key are pretty much endless. You can do some really dynamic things with them and add that realism to the Chroma Key footage that it's originally intended for. Well guys, I hope you've enjoyed this short tutorial. Uh, go over and check out the virtual reality sets that are available over at TubeTape.com. They have many different things over there. Uh, from lighting to my actual training DVDs to learn more about chroma key and video editing. Well, you guys have a cool and groovy evening, afternoon, or morning, whatever it is, wherever you are. I'm Mark Absalon, and I'm out of here because I've got some video editing to do.